please hit the subscribe button and tap the bell icon for the future notification to watch more videos of latest fashion and trends. Thank you so much for your Hello friends, welcome back to Amazing Means World. Here time another video of making beautiful designer sleeves. So let's quickly start with this designing. Very simple, stylish and following the simple techniques we can try it for already stitched blouses. So firstly we need to highlight the sleeve openings. For that I'd be using here the pearl lace followed with the chain bow lace. Five lines I applied here to give broadness on the sleeve opening. And now I'd be giving the markings of one inch gap lines like this. And now I'd be creating the flower shape using the designer flower rings of uh, applying the glue dots like this in the flower shape and this is how the flower rings would look maintaining the same gap in between these one inch lines I'd be sticking these these designer rings you can get in different sizes and different shapes as per your requirement and the customization of the pattern you can choose whatever you like this is how I have stuck the flower rings and on these lines I'd be applying the two glue dots this is to stick designer rings so here i'm taking two different sizes and shapes of designer rings all these materials which i have used for this designing are easily available in the fancy stores tailoring material shops also the links has given in the description box please check it so on the drew lines i'd be applying the two dots with the glue and sticking the designer rings of circular shape These are customized patterns. You can either increase the size or decrease the size as per your requirement. And this is how on the lines I have stuck the designer circular rings. And now I'd be applying the glue lines. This is to stick the chain bow lace on these lines. I had already measured and accordingly we have to cut it. Then apply the glue to stick these chain bow laces. Instead of chain ball lace, you can also try with the pearl lace or any stone lace of different colors. Now between these flowers also I'd be applying the glue lines to stick the chain ball lace. This is how the pattern will be continued on the complete sleeve designing. Now that the glue is completely dried, we have to give an invisible stitches on it. For that, I'd be using cotton silk thread and nine number hemming needle. Leaving little gaps in between, we have to give an invisible stitches on it. Each and every line of chain bow lace, also these designer rings, we have to give an invisible stitches. This is to stay for long run, even after the frequent washes. And preferable wash is dry wash or the light wash. Or you can also try with the sh because the pattern is continuing with the gold work. We need to follow certain precautions so that the color will not fade out. And this is how we have to give the stitches. Now on these designer rings, I'd be applying the glue dots. Center one with the red color kundun of very small size followed with the rhinestones. I'd be sticking here in all flower shaped designer rings. And two designer rings will be followed with the pearl work. For that, I'd be using one mm size of pearls. This is how we have to give stitches. And in between these designer rings, I'd be stitching the beads of two mm size along with the sugar bead. Both I'd be inserting at a time and giving the stitch for the joining of these gold color beads. And once the designing on the pattern completed, this is how the final lookout would look. 
it's really very simple and design. this is how i have converted my simple plain blouse to new designer blouse i hope sharing of this wonderful idea is useful to you all if you really enjoyed watching this video please hit the like icon to support my efforts also do share this video in your community or circles may be useful to others thank you so much for watching friends meet you all with another interesting video subscribe to amazing women's world channel stay tuned to watch more videos of latest fashion and